I'm Elizabeth Matthews in Wilmington, where we will soon get an update from emergency management about the Kankakee River and the potential for flooding. Right now, there's a flash flood warning for southwestern Will County. That goes from this morning, around 9.15 this morning through Saturday morning. Take a look at what the river looks like today. This is video we shot just a couple of hours ago. You may remember the video that we showed you about a week ago. The river frozen solid in and around Wilmington. Now, at least you see the river flowing, but also large chunks of ice that could possibly cause another jam or add to it. Now there's rain in the forecast for tonight, which will make the ice melt faster, but potentially increase the possibility for flooding. One resident we talked to has a summer home on the river and says over the past week, things have changed. It came up crazy high, settled down and, um, you know, you saw it, you saw it go down a little bit and now um, with things breaking upriver, and downriver still packed. I think that's what we're we're in for some trouble yet. So you're concerned about the big chunks of ice gathering, right. blocking it. Exactly. When they start jamming up again, the water's got nowhere to go. We do expect to learn more in just about 15 minutes for a, with a press conference from emergency management, county officials about what they expect to do with this possibility of flooding. We do know that Will County EMA has uh, ice monitors out and about monitoring the ice situation, looking at the river, checking in. And we've also been told that residents should be ready to evacuate if necessary on very short notice. Reporting live, Elizabeth Matthews, Fox 32, Chicago. The other issue we're worried about, limited visibility down near zero, Morris, O'Hare, Waukegan, we're at zero visibility at Gary, also Rensselaer, Valparaiso, Michigan City. Now this will improve as some rainfall moves in during the evening hours. You can see the leading edge of that rain through the Rock Valley, down through the Illinois Valley, that's sweeping our direction. We'll see that as we go through the evening hours and improved visibility. We'll also though have the threat for additional flooding from this rainfall. How much rain will we see? We'll talk more about that. Plus I've got the weekend forecast coming straight ahead.